And hello guys, welcome to this tutorial. Today I will be teaching you guys how to make a game that's kind of like cookie clicker. So like you just click a cookie and stuff like that. Let's get started. So first we're gonna need a background for this game. I'm just gonna use like you know a scratch default. Um, make it red. I mean, that's all right for the game, I guess. Um, in your background, you're obvi obviously gonna make it, you know, more cooler, creative. I'm just gonna go through the script thing in this video. So right now, I'll delete that script. So right now, we have a cookie and so when someone clicks the cookie we want there to be sort of like an animation of the cookie popping up and then going back down to do this we're gonna click events and then we're gonna do um... Uh, no not when flag is when this sprite is clicked so whenever the cookie is clicked looks it will go up so, so um... change size by 10 and then we're gonna wait one second but it's gonna be like 0 0.5 and then looks we're going to make it go back down to its original state by adding minus 10 so let's look at it now so when you click it it goes up and then it goes down but I think you know 0 0.5 seconds is too long let's make it 0 0.25 goes up and down. I still think that's a bit too long. 15. That's still a bit too long. Um, how about this? Yeah, that's good. So, this simple script is the animation of the cookie going up and down. Yay. Okay, so now we're going to need a variable that could store the data of the score so we're gonna say score and then when you click this variable it could change the like you know input of it or design of it so we're gonna make this variable like this and I'm gonna actually put it right here so now we're going to have to program this a uh, variable we just made so when flag is clicked we're going to have to set the variable to zero and then when the sprite is clicked we're going to change it by one so every time the sprite is clicked we're going to change it I mean the score by one so let's test it out so one two three four five six seven nine ten twelve yeah yeah as you can see the score is increasing while I am pressing the cookies and now we'll need like you know the score thingy so if you have like a hundred cookie I'm just gonna add like three symbols and then you guys will get the hang of it so we're gonna have to add a new sprite and then we're gonna have to call it I'm just gonna put a black background oh that big then text I'll make it white um I'm just gonna name it auto clicker um so one cookie per second one cookie per second and it cost and now I'm gonna add the cost 100 cookies 100 okay I'm just gonna add a hundred you guys will obviously make it um this sprite you know better so now let's get to the programming of this sprite so when f I mean no when this sprite is clicked if we'll need an operator 
to see actually we will need another something like this so if so right now we're going to check if the score as you can see we need a hundred cookies so if the score is a hundred or more than a hundred so if it's like above 99 it's gonna work like you could get the auto clicker so if score is greater than I mean if 99 is greater than the score wait no we're gonna have to think this through if score okay so if score is greater than 99 uh, change we'll need a data thing uh, change score by minus 100 we're doing 99 which actually means a hundred and above if you do a hundred it's gonna be hundred and one and above so we're gonna change score by one hundred which is the cost and then we're gonna wait wait and then actually we'll need a forever script change score by a hundred and then forever wait one second so we did one cookie per second so it's gonna change score by one each second so if flag is clicked if the score is equal to 99 and if you buy this thing the score is gonna add by one each time every second one cookie per second let's test this out so first we'll need a hundred cookies let me just click this a hundred times 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. So, now when I click auto clicker, let's see if the score goes down by 100 and if we get one cookie per second. So, yep, there we go. The score went down to 4 and now it's going up by 1 each second. So that's basically one of these things that you could do. And now we're going to add another one. Um, wait, first I'm actually going to add a picture that says like plus one or something like that in red. So whenever you click it, you know, so plus one scratch yeah I'm not gonna make it red I'll make it yellow okay so and I'm just gonna add some motions to I mean you know looks to this so forever um Let's see what we could do with this motion. Uh, glide and glide. Oh, I can't actually click this. Okay, so I'm just adding some, you know. Okay, so let's um, design to this. So whenever you click, it says plus one. So I will have to broadcast something because it's going to go to another script. So I forgot where broadcast. Okay, so broadcast message one. And here, if I receive message one, then it's going to do this. Not when flag is clicked. When I receive message one forever, okay. So show. And when flag is clicked, hide. So right now, when flag is clicked, it's gone. When you click it, it'll say plus one. And you keep on clicking it; it's going to go slower. And if you didn't click it for a long time, it's going to say plus one. So, yeah, it's pretty, it's just like a design thing. 
Your design will obviously obviously be different as this is not really that good. Um so go to front. We want this cookie to be I mean we want this thing to be at the front. So when flag is clicked, I see message one. Okay, there we go. Okay, so now we're gonna add another thing that happens like one hundred cookies per second. Or something like that. Um so if and let's make this worth like obviously this will be worth like you know like fifty thousand because it's a hundred cookies per second or something. So we're I'm just gonna make it fifty because of time, and I'll just change the image I guess. Your sprite will obviously be different than this one, as I'm just doing the scripting for this and. So this one is the secret one, so whenever you click it and you have 50 cookies, you just gotta change it by 50. So you're gonna get 50 cookies each time. If you have 50, so let's get 50 quickly. Thirty, forty, fifty. 40, 50. Now let's click this. We're going to get, so 40, 50, 100. 154. So the point of that was just to show you that you could, you know, change it to whatever you want. And then at the end you could put, like, you know, you could use, um, cloud data. I'm just gonna show you guys how to use cloud data right now. So make a variable, cloud variable, um, high score. Yep, we're using cloud data right now. So, when flag is clicked, I'm just gonna do this in the backdrop, so it's a background script. When flag is cl um, clicked, if. We'll need, oh, I forgot the if. So, if the score is bigger than the high score, then change high score to score okay so right now as you can see so right now look at the um, I'm gonna add a forever right here okay so now let's test it out so as you can see it's one and the high score was zero so it's gonna be one and now let's see we end the project and we wanna start again the high score will still be 1 because that's my high score. So it's like, you know, it's server based. And let's, like right now, I have 2 and the high score is 3. I'll click it. And now the high score and my score are tied. And when I get one more, I'll have 4. So the high score will be me, which is 4. Um, right now it's 7 for some reason. I don't know why. Oh my god, that's multiplying fast. Let me check the script. If Oh, I know why. It's because we're editing on this page. And now we're going to try it out. So the high score is 63. We're going to have to get to 63. As you can see, now everything is okay. And when I click share, everything will be okay. So now it's public. And you could click cloud data to see who actually got the highest score so I got the highest score that's my account um now it's just it out so 63 is the highest score we'll need 63 and right now you can see that there are no bugs whatsoever okay so we got 63 above 63 and the score went to 127 for some reason and we're gonna have to find the error. So score is equal to high score change score. I know the error. Do you guys see the error? We did change high score by score. That means whatever the high score is, it would be added to the amount of the score. And we don't want that. That's bad. We have to use set. So set high score to score. So now we're gonna save it and go to this page.
Now the high score is 127. We're gonna have to get. I'm actually gonna use the 50 hack thingy that we made. So 50. And now, as you can see, the high score is going to get there. Okay, so the score is 201. High score is 200. So like, as you can see, the high score is always changing because we got the high score. Now I could buy another one of this. I want to see if that doubles it. No, it doesn't. See this? Oh, that's pretty cool. So we bought both. If you buy it more than once, it does nothing. So that's pretty much how you guys play Cookie Clicker. As you can see, our high score is um, 957. That's what we got. So we're going to go to Cloud Data and see. So 957 score set by user Mastercard 786. So we made the high score. Thank you guys for watching. Today you learned how to make Cookie Clicker. And see you next time. Please subscribe to this channel.